So hi guys, hiya, Adam here. And today we're gonna be looking at colour changing milk. So, what colour do we normally associate with milk? That's it, obviously white. However, we are going to be changing the ordinary colour and making it more creative, more vibrant, so stay tuned. So for today's experiment, we will need milk, a small plate, some dish soap. I'm using Theory Up Liquid, but you can use any. Cotton swabs or cotton buds and a range of food colouring. So, our first step. Firstly, we need to add our milk to our plate so it covers the bottom. We are then going to add our food colouring. You can add as many colours as you want. I'm going with four today. Just a couple of little bobs in the centre of your milk. So a bit of blue, add a couple of drops of black here, and we're going to try and add the blobs next to each other. A little bit of orange now. As you can see, they're starting to move. And then finally, a little blob of green. And at the moment, as you can see, it's just some milk with a little bit of food colouring. Now we need to take our cotton bud, place it in our fairy up liquid or our dish soap that we use it, and just apply pressure to the middle of our plate. And as you can see, the colours start to move. If we change where we're placing it, it creates lots of different patterns, lots of colours to our food colouring. Okay, so now you've seen the magic happen, I, must, I am now setting you a small challenge to see if you can create your own ideas. So, how about using more colours, different colours to use, and maybe changing our liquid. What would happen if we used water instead of milk, or if we used a pot? this that's over to you okay so the reason for this experiment is the secret behind the bursting of colors and it's the chemistry of the tiny drop we used on the soap the fat molecules in the soap roll and twist in all directions to find each other and this causes the color molecules to be pushed and shoved everywhere so as i said you, the challenge is over to you Okay, so remember, once you have created your colour change in milk, to upload photos and videos to our Seesaw Classroom. There will be a, a guide at the end of our video to show you how to do so, and we'll also include the link that you need to use and the code. Thank you very much. I've been Adam Jones from Not In A Textbook. Hope you enjoy.